Yesterday, Qualcomm made a groundbreaking announcement about their latest processor, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3. If you're eager to learn how this chip will empower the upcoming Galaxy S24 Ultra, you're in for a treat. Benchmarks of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 on a test device have also been unveiled, and it's shaping up to be promising. It's now confirmed that Qualcomm's cutting-edge flagship processor, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, will exclusively power the forthcoming Galaxy S24 Ultra. However, versions of the Galaxy S24 and its S24 Plus, featuring the Exynos 2400 chipset, are expected to be available in Europe and Korea. In today's fast-paced tech landscape, any product needs to showcase its intelligence capabilities, especially when it comes to the chipsets that drive our smartphones. Qualcomm made sure to emphasize the AI coprocessor and other AI-related features when introducing the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chipset. In fact, it's aptly referred to as the Gen I. All the exciting advancements in AI make us wonder if there have been notable upgrades in processing power, and if so, how significant are they? First and foremost, what sets the S24 Ultra apart? Particularly from Google's Pixel 8 Pro, is its ability to perform AI magic right on the device. There's no dependency on an internet connection. In contrast, the Pixel 8 Pro relies heavily on Google's servers for AI processing, which can sometimes result in significant delays. Luckily, the S24 Ultra doesn't suffer from this issue, thanks to its robust chipset. Now you can quickly generate images from text directly on your phone. With the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, a process that previously took around 15 seconds now takes less than a second. That's truly impressive. Moreover, there's on-device personalization for AI in Samsung phones. Qualcomm leverages your device's sensors to personalize chatbot queries, ensuring you receive responses without having to provide every tiny detail in your query. But there's more. You can create AI backgrounds for videos, and video bulk effects have been enhanced for that cinematic feel. The Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 also supports Samsung's Zoom AnyPlace technology, enabling you to capture both 1x and 4x videos simultaneously while tracking objects. Now let's dive into the gaming experience. The new Adreno GPU is designed to provide graphics rendering that's 25% faster and 25% more power efficient. It's poised to elevate the gaming and streaming experiences on Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 devices. You can expect gaming at a remarkable 240 frames per second, combined with a 240 Hz refresh rate. This chipset is likely to feature prominently in gaming-oriented phones next year. Additionally, there's an Adreno Frame Motion Engine that can boost frame rates without increasing power consumption. The real showstopper is the ability to upscale games to 8K resolution on external monitors, courtesy of the Snapdragon Game Super Resolution feature. Moreover, the S24 Ultra will introduce a feature called Generative Fill, allowing you to crop and zoom photos directly on the device. The video features are equally exciting. There's an object eraser for videos with a simple tap, unwanted elements banish. Moreover, the night mode for videos extends up to 4K at 30 frames per second, enabling high-quality video capture in challenging lighting conditions. The chip can even enhance these videos to 4K at 60 frames per second. Last but not least, there's the vlogger view, which lets you simultaneously record video from both the main cameras. These are exciting features that will truly shine on Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 powered phones. The evolution of AI continues to shape technology, and it's unlikely to diminish anytime soon. So what are your thoughts on the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chipset? Do you believe it will make a significant impact in the world of Android? Feel free to share your insights in the comments section.